Hi guys, uh, I thought uh, to myself today that uh, a lot of people are using cars and uh, a lot of people own cars and drive cars, yet uh, so few people know how cars work. So I thought why not do a series of videos uh, explaining uh, how cars work and I start off with, uh, with the engine itself. And um, uh, the main component of an engine is the engine block and as the name says, uh, the engine block looks something like that and it's like a block hence the name and in that block you've got what they call cylinders now this engine I did here uh, has got like three cylinders and I'm doing here a dotted line basically so you know this cylinder goes right to the bottom each cylinder goes right to the bottom and um, so when you uh, um, in each cylinder what you got is a piston it is something like that and it has what they call a, a connection rod or a con rod and that piston is connected to what is called a crankshaft that piston goes up and down in those cylinders and this up and down rotation uh, motion causes the crankshaft to rotate and that crankshaft goes via gearbox via gearbox to your to your to your uh, 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 wheels or the wheels of your car and um, so basically when you hear a car has like four cylinders it what it has is like uh, one two three and then four cylinders or, or five cylinders or six cylinders and then there are engines which are called V, V6 or V. This is now an inline engine with three cylinders in line. And a V engine would look like that. It would have another, it's like a second engine, like this. All right. And here's your second bank of cylinders. So now I've got, instead of an inline three, I've got now a V6. And at the bottom of the engine, now the, the, whole, the whole block is like a V, that's why they're called a V. And here at the bottom, you, what you have is, let's hope I get it right, is the, is the crankshaft. And that crankshaft connects those, those uh, uh, pistons from both banks. And that crankshaft, as I mentioned before, drives then uh, the wheels. So basically, uh, when you hear like uh, something like a V8, so uh, that means like you've got two banks, the engine is, is uh, from the front, looking at the engine of, uh, in, uh, from the front, it looks like that, a V. And in each bank, you've got like four uh, cylinders, uh, hence eight, eight cylinders in total, V8. And in each cylinder, you've got a piston coming up and down. And right here is the crankshaft. And that crankshaft, it's, it's now done badly here in this drawing, but that crankshaft goes through the gearbox, uh, to the, uh, via the gearbox, to the uh, wheels and that drives the car. Now, how do these pistons go up and down? I'll explain that in the next video because I'll have to explain uh, the cylinder head which comes on top of the block. The cylinder head, which is looks something like that, and that comes on top of, 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 the, of the block. So in, ca in, in, in case of a, a V8 engine, or, a, or any V engine, you've got two cylinder heads, one, and then here a second one. And in that are like valves, camshafts, and stuff like that. I'll explain that in the next video.